I was wrong yesterday and I must apologize. Uh, I suggested that the uh, things that were found by the Ukrainian authorities in the Ukrainian Orthodox churches uh, in uh, across Ukraine amounted to no more than literature. It's not true. In the church of St. John of Krongstad, uh, near, well, in the Kherson region, the Ukrainian forces have found um, lock-up facilities, um, storage areas used by Russian troops and demonstrating absolutely that the Ukrainian Orthodox Church, that is the part of the church in Ukraine which is in union with the Moscow Patriarchate, even though it says it's cut off links, uh, and that's different to the Ukrainian church, which has formed an alliance with the Ecumenical Patriarchate, that's the church based in Istanbul, and indeed different to the Ukrainian Catholic Church, the Uniate Church, which is linked to the Church of Rome. So the Ukrainian Orthodox Church uh, clearly has monks in it who are fifth columnists and clearly in need of a clear out. So I'm afraid President Zelensky is absolutely right in targeting these people. They have been working with the enemy and you know the monks in the orthodox church are incredibly powerful incredibly influential across the community it's the monks in the west one tends to think of monks of being isolated and uh, enclosed in monasteries and never seen broadly speaking that is true but in the east it's the monks who are the powerhouse of the church it's the monks who become the bishops and the leaders in the church. It's the monks who do the uh, the homilies, the sermons in the church. It's the monks who um, are generally uh, the people uh, who, for, who, who are the confessors, who people go, the ordinary people go to for confession. The monks are the um, academics, the theologians, the ordinary priests, uh, who are generally married and tending their chickens in a local village, are there simply to do the liturgy and to get on with providing the basic day-to-day -day care of parish life. It's the monks who travel around and fire up the congregation. And it, therefore... Uh, the, um, the, the, there is a serious security risk in monks who are actually towing the party line of Patriarch Kirill across Ukraine. And that's very dangerous. President Zelensky is absolutely and fundamentally right to challenge uh, this, particular, uh, this particular ideology and this particular problem. And it's certainly not the first time that it's emerged in an orthodox setting. Meddlesome monks. And, uh, I, and I think we have to be very careful in looking at this from, a, from an orthodox position, from, a, from an eastern position, rather than assuming uh, a western understanding of monasticism um, but uh, yeah these people are dangerous and it's the same danger that one would have seen for example um, in the rise of somebody like a Rasputin <laughs>